Hey, it's Jeremy from OpticHouse.com. So, I am working on a sketch cover. I um, was commissioned to do this piece, uh, thank you Darren, by um, someone who's at the uh, Amazing Arizona Comic Convention. And I wasn't able to do this piece at the show because it required a little bit more detail and uh, he had some very specific reference for the, the characters he wanted. And they are not X-Men characters, even though I'm doing it on a sketch cover of a uh, Age of the Age of Apocalypse book. Um, I learned something interesting in doing this piece just about uh, the drawing videos that I've been posting. Usually, I just, whenever I'm sitting down and I'm, I'm working on some sort of art piece, I'll turn the camera on. At some point during the week, I'm able to get, you know, something in. So that way I can post one video a week. And I will have to tell you that in the beginning of the year, from like January through through February, there have definitely been you know some weeks where I literally did not get any drawing done, and I think I burned through a bunch of videos that I had pre-recorded already. And by the time uh, Amazing Arizona came along, I had to prep for the show. Um, I was busy getting uh, my art book ready. And I just did not have time to, to sit down and draw any stuff. And when I sat down, you know, this is the first week back from the convention, I sat down to start working on the commission, I realized that just in the, the one evening that I sat down to work on this, I finished it basically in one sitting. However, you know, I ended up recording three videos worth of material. So I realized if I'm ever just running out of pieces or don't have time to do something, just... I should grab whatever is the next illustration that I want to work on, put it on my drawing table, and just sit aside an hour or two to work on it. And that alone will give me enough, you know, at least I'll be able to get two drawing videos out of it. So it's good to get that done. Um, oh, speaking of my art book, I should probably also mention that my first art book, Wound, The Art of Jeremy Burley, is now available on Amazon, and I will include a link at the bottom of the video. It's a 52-page art book, full color, 8.5 by 11. So it's a slim volume, but it's a collection of some of my favorites, favorite pieces I've done over the past few years. Um, hopefully it should be the first of many that I plan to do in the future. But uh, that's available now. And as far as this piece goes... You know, part of the com complexity is that I've got this one character who's being mounted by another while she's, you know, performing some, some ritualistic magic, you know, blood magic there. So she's got him tied up and she's, you know, cutting him. And it was just drawing these intertwined bodies at this very specific angle with a lot of foreshortening going on, you know, plus she's, you know, sitting astride him that... This would have been a very difficult piece for me to do at a convention, so it was nice to be able to come sit down here at my drawing table and work it out. Um, the next videos, you'll see me add some color and some inks. So that is it for now. Go be creative.